Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. How is everybody doing during this quarantine that we're all having to be a part of? Um, unfortunately, right, uh, right now, a lot of the country actually has pretty much shut down majority of the things that they do, um, especially because, you know, hey, like we can't be in big groups of people. There's a lot of people that recently have gotten sick and you know we just need to be safe from this whole thing that is going on but in the meantime i did want to of course create some content because hey i'm indoors um there's really nothing else to do but to be behind camera and connect with you guys i've been doing some instagram lives lately and i had done a review on my boxy charm palette from my previous video um i just haven't worked on actually <coughs> uploading it only because i was like having the worst time with my phone, like everything. It's just nothing came together that day. So that video is still pending to be uploaded. But if you guys saw my review on that palette on my Instagram live, you know exactly what I'm talking about when it comes to saying that I was not impressed with it. Considering that BoxyCharm is, you know, uh, pretty much where I get all of my stuff. Like even this palette right here is from BoxyCharm. And I will say that um, the colors here are amazing and hopefully they are very, very pigmented because that is what exactly we are looking for. So um, again, guys, we are just hanging out together behind closed doors until everything is back to normal. I do have like a little, <clears throat> so I'm in my dining room area. Um, I do have a mirror here that I brought from my restroom that I, I actually bought this mirror at like a Marshalls or something or like a Ross. So it was very inexpensive and I was not willing to pay like freaking $20, $30 for a mirror that I mean, I can pay like 10 bucks and get the same thing. So that's what I did, right? Cause I'm cheap. So we're priming the eyes and as always, <clears throat> Because I haven't bought a, new, bought a new primer, I've been asking everybody's opinions on what is the best primer to use for eyeshadow. So um, we're gonna learn. But for now, we are using the Wet n Wild Photo Focus Eyeshadow Primer. Um, I think for me, being somebody that's learning how to do this whole thing, it has been a very, very good experience to learn with something like that. Um, because it is like, it was cheap and it's easy to use really. <clears throat> so we're gonna go straight in. I wanna use obviously colors like this, like that. So we are going to go straight in and add some blue. Why not? But again guys, everybody just needs to stay indoors and stay healthy. I recently started taking actually like a multivitamin. It's like Centrum, I think. And I feel like an old person, but it actually helped <laughs> a lot. So I'm just like tapping the color in so I can build up this blue shade right here. And I'm using like a detailed brush to do that. Obviously you can tell this is a very pigmented eyeshadow, so. It's definitely sticking. I like that color a lot, actually. Ooh. But so far, so good. It does look very nice. I actually really like this shade a lot. Blue is like, I think, one of my favorite colors. Like, I know that's real basic, but like, I'm super into the color like blue and the color red just those two colors are like favorite i've always had this dream guys that like i owned a red range rover so we'll get there mm. but guys apparently there's certain areas here where i am from that are actually now doing curfew um it was like scary to kind of hear that that's happening because just didn't expect a curfew to have to be applied. 
But I guess like as a as people, because I'm like that too, and I know a lot of you guys maybe are. Like we don't listen, you know. Like we're still like trying to be out, like do things that we know we're not supposed to. Um, so this color was called Mystic Ice. I forgot to tell you what color it was. But so like, we're just building it in and I mean, it's very, very pretty. I love it. So there we have it. Now we're gonna do the other eye. I usually do like, well, not usually because this is the first time I'm doing it, but I usually add like, create like a little line here like that. And then that's how I will separate what else I'm gonna do. But I love this shade. This for sure has to be like one of my favorite blues that I've ever tried. You know, come to think of it, I think I don't have a lot of blue or red. I know I tried a red recently. <clears throat> it just did not do it for me. Like it really didn't do anything, guys. There was no color. There was no pigment on it at all. It sucked. Which is like disappointing, you know, cause like red is so pretty. But I have heard like so certain colors are very hard to make. So I'm sure that's where it comes from. So ever since this happened guys, like I had already, I actually had gotten sick. So I don't know, I had maybe like a cold. I really don't know. I didn't get tested for anything specific. But I did start meds. I took all my meds already. So like I've already finished them. And I do feel a lot better already. Like uh, this multivitamin that I'm taking really, really helped a lot. So like if anybody's out there feeling like they don't have any energy or like they need a little pick me up, I would definitely recommend to start a little multivitamin. I know my doctor had already been telling me to start one, but I just haven't. And like, to be honest with you guys, I'm not really a person that eats breakfast. Like, I've just never been that type. But ever since I started this multivitamin, I wake up hungry, like with energy, and like, it's good for me. Maybe like that's what I needed this whole time. <laughs> I don't really feel like that grumpy either. Like sometimes I'll wake up grumpy, but she's good. So building this color up is so pretty. Like it's so easy to just build it up. I wasn't sure how deep I wanted this yet, so that's why I've been taking a little bit. But obviously I already messed it up a little bit, but whatever. It is just to play with makeup and talk to you guys a little bit because I am just bored in my apartment and there's really nothing else to do but film. So the next color we're gonna go in with is gonna be this one here. It is called Lunar Eclipse. And so it's like an orange shade. Oh, it's too close. <laughs> this little mirror has a light too. I love it. Okay. Cute. Ooh. This is so pretty also already. Like, look at that. And so same thing, like we're just gonna tap it in and build it up. I, the way that I switched the colors was with my Ulta Beauty New Hue Shadow Switching Pan. It is everything. Like, 
so easy to go from one color to the next, for sure. And, ooh, I love that. I'm pretty sure that when I was in middle school, we had like a team. I don't remember for what, but it was like a team, right? And I'm pretty sure this was the colors that we had for our team. It was like academic team. I don't remember why we had that though. I think to kind of like create competition. But it was, it was a cute idea, I guess. The only thing with that is that there was always people that were like, oh, if you're not part of this team, you're not that smart. <laughs> Girl, bye. Okay. Guys, you know what would be so interesting is to kind of like do my job from home. Only because like my job like yeah, I know what I'm doing, but in my job description, I'm kind of expected to really go outside of the box for like a customer. Like I have to like basically come up with something to tell my customer, like sale wise, like, oh, let me see what I can do for you. Like all this different stuff. Like it's, it's just, it's so much to explain, like, you guys would never understand. But, if I have to work from home, like, I can't, and I can't just, like, go on hold and ask, like, my supervisor for, like, hey, what do I do, right? Because he's not there. So that's gonna be interesting. For fucking sure. Ooh, that's pretty. I will say that I think this is one of the first times that this primer has like really, really like worked for me. Um, which I can see where I have a little streak on this eye from where I applied it not that well. But other than that, we love it. I love this pigment too. It is everything. Ooh. I got like lost in my thoughts there guys for like a second. <laughs> Whoa. <clears throat> this is definitely something that I love a lot, like these colors. But I do remember that in my middle school, like we literally had um, like a team and I'm pretty sure these were the colors. Guys, also one more thing that I would say about this vitamin 
is like I'm always getting hungry now. Like I legit ate breakfast and then within like two hours, I legit felt like I was already hungry again. But that is good though, because like, I'll be able to build muscle a lot faster than what I usually do. So we've been working out. I already actually feel that like <laughs> in the short time that I've been working out cause we've been quarantined for already like a week. Also, if you guys hear any noise, it's just my dog moving around in his cage right now. And breathing as well. Okay. So then we're just switching the color and done. So now I think we're gonna do the color zero gravity right here. And I think what we're gonna do is we're just gonna add that here to make it seem like my eye is like a different shape. I don't know, well, we're gonna try it. Okay. So I think it's kind of not funny, but I think it's very interesting how like this whole social distancing thing, you know, like having space and stuff between people like at the store, like did people really not know what personal space was? Cause they kind of feel like sometimes people are real in your personal space. Like, like I'll be like, I don't know, there's like HEBs here where I'm from. And like, I'll be in line. And like, you know how you put your groceries? And like the person's already like trying to like, basically push you into like paying, like girl, relax. And so like this whole thing with social distancing, I think is a good thing. Like, give me my space, you know, there's something called personal space. Like if you're like within a hand's reach from me, like you're in my personal space. And I can most guarantee you that anytime in a line, in HEB, if I go like this, I'll most definitely be reaching into their cart. And that's like so annoying. Like that shouldn't be something that I have to worry about on a daily basis, which whenever I go to HEB, I always have to worry about that. It's so annoying. Like it gives me anxiety to feel another person like basically like breathing on me to like pay you know and that again is just ugly so now with social distancing keep your personal space because i keep mine and we'll be good and we'll be healthy apparently too Love it. So this is just like an interesting little look. I mean, I'm not going anywhere. So, yeah. 
So this color was called Zero Gravity. I like it a lot, actually. I don't remember if this brand was from Texas. Yeah. These are people from Texas. Distributed by Kristen Dominique Incorporated, Texas. Cute. Well, Texas love right here. You see, I love stuff like that. Like, we're both from Texas. Um, now that I know that. And we're doing a little cute review on them. So I think we obviously need to add some more color to this just to really give my eyes a um, pop of color more than I already do. So I think with this shade right here called Lucid Dream, we're going to just start adding that to the bottom of the eye just to give it that pop of color. And trying to like figure out which is the easiest way. Ooh, yes. And so we're just like stamping it on. Well, actually not. This is very pigmented. Whoa. Guys, this shade is everything like it really is whoa this adds so much dimension to this look i love that i'm pretty sure i'm not gonna be able to get the other eye the same but we will try Also guys, I've been super annoyed with my Apple Watch recently because it is not giving me any of my notifications. Like, ugh, over you. Like, I saw the notification coming onto my phone, but my watch didn't tell me anything. Okay, what did I have before? So obviously that needed to be done. We needed some more color here. Uh, this tickles my eyelashes so badly. <laughs> you guys have no clue. And yes, guys, I know I have this habit of keeping my mouth open when I do something like this. Sorry, sorry, sorry. If you guys can hear like little vacuums and stuff, I like live right next to a um, a car wash. Um, I have my back window open so you can hear it coming in. Oh yes, I love this color. And so you see with that switching pan, we just take it right off. We took all the other three shades off. Now we obviously need to add some little pop of color here. So we're gonna do that now. Um, obviously these could be blended a lot better. Like I can add a lot more color to them, but it's just to do a quick little review on this palette. So let's do, oh, I didn't really pick up anything actually. Um, but it is showing up. Yeah, we can see her. And this is a brush that's not wet. Oh 
yes. Guys, this palette is everything so far. Like, I am so in love with it. And that looks pretty. This, this like glitter is so good. Like it is really, really pretty. <clears throat> so we like pretty much used all the shades. We used that one, that one, that one. Um, I don't think I used that one. I used that one and I used that one. Mm, where else can we add more color? I mean, I can like, just like tap a little bit more in, but it's just to kind of bring that pigment back to this. But other than that, like this is pretty much where I was trying to go with this whole look. Just add a little bit of color, you know, like give a little dimension to the eyes that I don't normally have. Um, and then just show you guys like an amazing product that I have received from BoxyCharm. That way when I upload the next video, including the BoxyCharm palette, you guys can see what I'm talking about because it was really disappointing. Um, I'm used to having pigment and well, let's just say that maybe that palette is not the most pigmented um, as of right now. But I do wanna thank you guys again for taking the time to watch this whole video. And of course, spend some time with me during your quarantine. Um, you guys enjoy the rest of your quarantine. And have a good one, okay? Bye, guys.